This is a Quantum Edge 3. This is the newest in the uh, new line of power chair from Quantum Pride Mobility. It's a Quantum Edge 3. This power chair has four miles. So you, again, practically brand new, as you can see, four miles. This chair has the 12 inch seat lift, the electric tilt, the electric recline, and the electric legs. Now on this chair, all the function have to be worked through the joystick, okay? So you would come to your joystick right here to work the function, and you would hit the button on the left forward until you get to a picture of the seat. When you get to a picture of the seat, whatever is in the color is what's going to be happening. So this is the tilt. I'm going to move the joystick sideways. This is the tilt and the legs together. The legs. This is only the seat lift. So that's the first one I'm going to show you. So right now, once you have it in that picture, you would push the joystick back and your seat will start going up. You will start at 22 inches when you start down, you got to add 12 inches. By the time you're all the way up, you'll be at 34 inches. And that's why they call it eye level, because by that time you'll be eye level with someone. If you're talking to someone, you'll be eye level. This is the only company where this chair will drive at three, three miles an hour while the seat is elevated. So I'm not going to be able to show you that in here, but you can see that it, it does move around pretty good. So this is, you can still drive this chair with the seat elevated. Now while we have the seat elevated, let's look at the bottom. This is a Quantum Edge 3, the newest power chair. You can see the seat lift. We've got four point seat lift. You can see it's like an X right here, two on this side, two on this side. You can see the actual motor for the seat lift is right here. You've got anchor points here and here. This is where you would tie your chair to your lift or to your van if you had to travel and you want to secure your power chair. 14 inch solid wheel with matching caps that match the color of the chair. You've got a motor for each wheel. Each wheel has a motor. There's a motor on the opposite side. This chair weighs 400 pounds, so it's really, you can't push it unless you put it in neutral. So if you're going to put it in neutral, make sure the seat is all the way down and your power is off. Because if you leave the power on, you'll have some resistance in the motor. So I'm going to put this motor in neutral right here and you'll see how, how easy it is now with one hand. I can move the wheel right here, okay? So you have to do both sides and you can push it around, but this chair does weigh 400 pounds. Power, uh, put, the, put it back in gear, turn your power back on, and you're ready to go again. I wanna show you the suspension on this chair. Look at the suspension in the front of this chair. Look how large that suspension is on both sides. It's a great looking suspension, heavy duty suspension, and you have the same suspension in the back. That same suspension here, you've got two of these up front. You can adjust it by turning this ring right here. You can make it tighter or looser. Okay? So, so far, we have covered the 12 inch seat lift. What I'm going to do is I'm going to place it back here. There we go. And I'm going to bring the seat back down. I'm going to put it back in the seat mode. And we're going to bring the seat back down. Now, while the seat goes down, this is called a swing away joystick. So you can swing the joystick away from the front just by doing that. Everything is set up on the left side, but if you're right-handed, we can put everything back to the right side, no problem at all. This is called a swing away joystick, so you can swing it away from the front if you needed to uh, move it out of the way. Okay? So now, the next function I'm going to show is called the electric tilt. The electric tilt is when the base right here, the base right here goes back. So when this base goes back, it's going to take the legs and it's going to take the back together with it. This is called the electric tilt. This is a real neat function. We're going to see how far it goes. Okay, the next function I'm going to do is the electric legs. Now these legs, they'll go up and they'll go out a couple inches. If you watch real carefully on the video, you'll see they'll go up and they'll go out and give you an extra couple inch when they get to the top. Okay, I guess these don't go up, they don't go out. So I was wrong on that. So they'll go up and that's it. So this is, if you had your legs up like this and your tilt, this would be extreme. Uh, if you needed some circulation, you could do it this way, but you could also do it this way. So if you needed some circulation, 
you could still be up like this. And I think your legs are still going to be higher than your body. And you can still have good circulation. I'm going to bring the seat back down. So far, we've covered three functions. The last function we're going to cover now is called the electric recline. So the electric recline is when the back goes back. So this is the back right here going back by itself. That's called the electric recline. And we'll see how far this one goes back. This is your electric recline. So if you were laying down and all the way down with your chair, this is what it would look like. Now I'm going to bring the, the back and the legs down together at the same time. You can do two functions at once. So right now I'm bringing the legs down and I'm bringing the back back up at the same time. And these legs are adjustable. So if you're five feet tall or six foot tall or six foot three, we can adjust the length of these foot plates. They'll still be electric, but we can adjust them with no problem at all. Okay, I'm going to put the chair back into drive. So these foot plates do flip up, so when you exit the chair, there's nothing in front of you. The seat on this chair is 18 by 20 inches. This is a super, you can just see, it's a very, very comfortable seat. The arms do flip up. You have lateral pads here which keep your knees from falling, your knees together, keep your feet from coming off your foot plate. You do have your safety belt right here. Also with this power chair, two things, you've got elbow pads. Very nice. So if you're tilted back, your arm is not going to come off your, it's not going to slide back because you have elbow pad protections. That's a, that's a custom, that's custom. The headrest is also custom. This headrest has a contour, so it keeps your head in the middle. So your head's not going to want to bobber on both sides. So it's going to stay in the middle of your headrest. This is a mid-wheel drive chair, so it turns on its own length. So you can see this, how it turns. The back of the chair, we've got what's called an attendant control. I can drive this chair from here by switching the controls right here. When I switch the controls here, on this button right here, I can go forward now, I can go reverse, I can turn the chair around, and do all the functions that I can do up front. I can also do the tilt, the recline, the seat lift, all from here. When this is on, the one in front is not going to work. So when you turn this one back off, and you put the attendant control here, you have to turn your power back on front, you have to turn that power back on if you want to have the front working again. So now the front is working again. Back here, we've got bag hooks. So if you want to carry a backpack, you've got actually these hooks right here. This is custom also, okay? Another thing about this chair, it is equipped with light. It has the light kit. So you might not be able to see really good right now, but I'm gonna turn the lights on. There's a little tab right back here. You can see the headlights right here. <clears throat> and you can see the rear lights in the back of the chair. So you have headlights and rear lights. <clears throat> when you charge this chair, you'll take your charger and you'll plug it right, let me turn the lights off. Charger, plug it in the front of your joystick. As soon as the light turns green on your charger, it'll stop charging the battery. So this, these are smart chargers. They know when to stop. All right, let's do a quick recap. We've got a Quantum Edge 3 power chair. The color is purple. Four miles on this power chair, practically brand new. Four miles, fully loaded. 12-inch seat lift, electric tilt, electric recline, electric legs. It also is equipped with a light kit on the fenders. You have lights on the fenders. You've also got lateral pads, which is custom. You've got elbow pads back here, which is also custom. You've got your safety belt. You have your swing away joystick that can be transferred to the right side if you had. And you also have in the back of this chair, you've also got back here, the attendant control, 
the fully adjustable headrest that can also be removed if you don't want it on there. So, and this chair has four miles and it's ready to go. These chairs are so smooth. This is, the, this is the Quantum Edge 3. This is the one with the electric 12 inch seat lift, the electric tilt, the electric recline, the electric legs. And I'm going to raise the seat up right now so you can see the seat going up. This is the one when the seat is elevated, this chair will go about three miles an hour with the seat elevated. Up from 22 to 34 inches, which is eye level. And this is why they call them eye levels. And we're almost there. And I'm going to put it back in drive here. And this is with the seat elevated. This is the only chair that drives at three miles an hour with the seat elevated. Gorgeous power chair, purple in color, fully loaded, four miles ready to go. Hi, I'm Mark. And my name is Alex. We are a family owned business for over 25 years. We have many products available, not just what you see in this video. If you would like to learn more, you can call the number below at 800-677-6293 or you can visit us directly at www.marksmobility.com.